Today I'm working on a Tesla Model S. You know, these cars are amazing because it's not only uh, <clears throat> all aluminum, but uh, the way the paint is put on these cars and the clear coat, it's just an amazing finish, super strong. Today I gotta fix that dent right there. Now, you know, steel is a lot easier to glue pull. Aluminum, not so easy. You need tremendous power to pull aluminum. And what you don't want to do is miss. You don't want to put a pull just next to this or on this side of it. You need just accuracy and you need power. You don't want to lift it and chop it in half because you didn't have a complete pull of the entire perimeter. So if you pour glue on a tab and stick it in there, as the tab flexes, if it's plastic and flexible, it'll only pull a little bit in the middle. The rest kind of gets lost in that flex. You want as much power and accuracy as you can, and that's why I'm gonna do it with steel tabs. All right, apply the tab. Don't squeeze too hard. You need some thickness there to keep it all together, but at the final last, I guess three seconds, give it a nice push. Let's get our slot bar in position. And use this seam right here. We just let's see, clip it right in. There it goes. Now this tab is maybe what six years old. This slot bar is six years old. It's amazing how well it's held up. Fits in there real nice, snug. This is all ready to go. No, no flex anywhere. There's no plastic, no plastic to sag. Now always use number one. Don't go to number two, that's too fast. Wow, that was a great pull. Look at that. Even a great slot bar pull. Aluminum, it just kind of laughs at you. You need amazing torque to pull a body line out of an aluminum panel. So now we're gonna really ramp it up. Go with a smaller bead inside that and just put an insane pull on it. Not too bad on that one. Got a little pull in the middle, you know. I mean, we've got to keep going for that line. So I think it's time now to release some of this pressure and this over here, and then really just flatten it out to get some really nice pulls in the middle. On aluminum, you do not want to fight these crowns while pulling. You just, you just are asking for trouble. Too many pulls, too much time wasted. You gotta go right into crowns on aluminum. Wow, look at that. Really raised that body line well. Get that out of the way for you. Look at the metal. Oh, I'm good. Wow. Some aggressive tapping again. Should take about another five, six more pulls. So each pull has produced results. That's what you want. You don't want to be here 25 pulls later. Okay, all done. This came out really nice. The customer can't even find it. This is what it looks like in the natural. I mean, that's the thing. In the natural, this is what customers are looking at. And you cannot even find this thing. 